Looking for more ways to lock down your Android? I think you should be. Here's a couple of ways to do it. I'm Kurt the Cyber Guy. Follow me at cyberguy.com where my newsletter is free. The first thing to note is that settings may vary depending on your Android phone's manufacturer. Now, there are a couple of standard options for locking your phone. Do this. Navigate to settings on your phone, and let's go ahead and tap that. And then scroll down to security and privacy, and let's tap that. Then tap lock screen. Next, we're gonna select screen lock, and put your current password, pin, pattern, etc. And now you have a list of all the options you can use, whether it's a pin, a pattern, or a password. Select the option you'd like to set, and well, now let's get your biometric options going. Hit the arrow in the top left to go back. Next, if your phone has a fingerprint scanner, you may consider selecting fingerprints as another form of security. Input your current password to access these. Here you can rename any set of fingerprints, add new fingerprints, and check what fingerprints are already named. You're going to want to make sure fingerprint unlock is toggled on so you can use it on your lock screen. Now let's go back with the top left arrow. Tap face recognition. Input your current password, and if you haven't already set face recognition, it'll prompt you to press continue and hold your phone in front of your face to capture your likeness. Now once that's done, you're gonna have options to remove your face data from your phone or capture alternative styles you might wear. So for example, you've got your glasses on or you wear a hat, so your phone can now more accurately recognize you in any of the looks you normally wear in life. You want more quick tips like this, head to cyberguy.com. Also, you can comment below and my newsletter is free if you go to the website.